Hola, we're back. Now we're going to use a yummy, delicious salsa that we made with featuring Tapatio hot sauce. I'm here with my friend, April Leslie, as well as Chef Andrew from the Cosmopolitan Hotel here and Restaurant in downtown San Diego, Old Town. And we're going to take that yummy salsa, we're going to have it with chips, para más sabor, you can also put it in an omelet. So now, April, what's your cooking background? Pretty much slim to none. All right, so this is so cereal. easy that people that make cereal can make this omelet. So basically, Chef Andrew said all we really need is one zucchini, one summer squash, and a handful of asparagus. So, would it be asparagus? Asparagus. There you go. All right, so we're going to continue. I'm going to let the master chef show you the technique for Ooh, cutting uh, up. Okay, I need lessons big time. Very easy. A little one? Sure. Okay. Great. Take your hands off. Okay. Perfect. Start it. Cut it in half. So now she's just cutting in half. Cut it in half. Cut it in half. You're cutting it in half? Ooh, that's an interesting technique. Very good. So, uh, what do you call that in culinary arts? The perpendicular cut. Cut it in half. Okay. Cut it in half. <laughs> Yes, I'm cutting in half. That looks pretty. I'll this way three times. This way no. three times? Like this, I'll show you. Alright, so now. Ooh. That's you make so easy. easy. This, this way. I probably do. Whoa. You can down here with a small dice. Oh, okay. Wow. That is really good. Good job, Ace. It's making me hungry. Easy as cereal. Yes. Okay. Asparagus, you didn't say because you're down. You never go to the end. The ends are very woody. Okay. So we're going to use the end of the asparagus. Ooh, okay. I can help with that. Sure. So go ahead. So we're just cutting off the ends of the asparagus because it gets woody at the end there. <laughs> they snap off easily. <laughs> That's good. It's not like the snap peas. Like, you're so good at this, April. We were talking the other day that April should be a hand model because she'll leave your hands. <laughs> <laughs> she has really pretty fingers. So does Jess. They're, they're from being a musician. Well, your hands, I think, win. But she, you opted out of being a hand model because of why? Oh, I forgot. Because <laughs> you have to wear gloves every day. Oh, yeah. If you're a hand model, you have to be crazy and you, you can't cut. <laughs> And you can't no. make zucchini in summer yeah. squash. No, and tapatio. Uh -huh. so, so, forget you know, that. Forget yeah. that. Forget All right, Chef Andrew. So after we've discarded our woody sections, we have the cool cuts, we have this going on. How do we do this number over here? Same exact way. All right. Perfect. Top ends. Absolutely. Okay. So we're going to discard the ends there. And my stomach is actually growling. Perfect. We go over the stove and cook up the second one. Wonderful. And half. Cut lengthwise, if I remember in my lesson. Good job, Apes. <laughs> fancy. Okay, then we do this, put it down, do it three times. I'm gonna go the, the thicker side because I'm not as good. Now, where does the tapatio Perfect. come into play on this? We well, already have it in your salsa, but when we add it in the lettuce one. Oh, it's gonna be extra spicy. I'm gonna go this way three times. That's a really cool technique. It's so colorful too. In the summertime, you got all these beautiful vegetables and fruits coming up. Mm. Can't beat it. My parents have a really yummy vegetable garden. Oh, nice. So they do all of these vegetables. We were hoping in our garden outside. Okay. All right, stick with us. We're going to show you the omelet in just a second. Hi, everybody. It's Jesse J. This is part two of the omelet. Do you remember one of my best friends, April, cut up the zucchini, the summer squash, and we added that with the asparagus and the salsa that we made from episode number one. And now we're going to add, Chef, what are the portions here? What are we adding? How many eggs are in here? Give myself, I'll add them three eggs. It's the perfect size. I'm going to just go about anybody. Three eggs. And then how much cheese would you suggest shredding? That's about four ounces. We're going to use about half and half. We're going to use half for inside and half for garnish on top. Okay. Now, some people want to go like low fat. Would they use low fat cheddar cheese? Absolutely. Or what about like, um, you know, soy cheese? Soy cheese. Tofu, whatever you want. Cheese, whatever you want. Absolutely. So you just need some sort of like specialty dish. And now we're going to be cooking with butter because it's delicious. Absolutely. Now what are some butter alternatives people can use? 
Olive oil. 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 Olive oil